Matthew chapter 24, reading from verse 10. Matthew chapter 24, we're looking at verse 10. And then shall many be offended, and shall betray one another, and shall hate one another. In verse 11, it says, And many false prophets shall rise and deceive many. Then in verse 12, it says, And because iniquity shall abound, the love of many shall wax cold. He does not want our love to wax cold. He wants us to continue. And he wants us to keep on loving him with all our heart, with all our soul and with all our mind he does not want to use past tense for salvation for sanctification for our holiness for our service for our affection for our intimacy unto him he wants it to be the ever present experience that the way we loved him in the past we still love him like that today but because iniquity shall abound the love of many shall wax cold then he says in verse 13 but he that shall endure unto the end the same shall be saved what a revelation that um, the joy of yesterday is not enough for today the faithfulness of yesteryears that's not enough for today and the commitment and the consecration and the love of God of yesteryears is not enough for today it's not an historical experience 19 such and such 20 such and such I was born again present day expectation of the Lord is a present life in holiness and righteousness.